it has been a while. Um, I'm a little ill at the moment, so you'll have to excuse my voice. But I just felt like I wanted to record a bit. Um, 1.15 is coming. Well, obviously 1.15 is out. Us updating to 1.15 is coming. Um, we're still waiting on Optify at the moment, I believe. But it's close. But in the meantime, I just wanted to start on another project, and I've come in here and I've seen a, a puffer fish on the floor, and then I walked over here, and uh, someone's puffer fished me. I'm going to have to be careful with this. I was tempted for a second there to just open this up, but then it'll wash away my redstone, so... <sighs> God, it's been so long since I've played Minecraft, I'm forgetting the buttons. Is that it? Just one? Oh, I've picked up three of them. Okay, so three of them died. Fine. I keep pressing tab to open my inventory. What have I played lately that had tab for inventory? Terraria? Haven't played that in a little while though. Puffer fished. Fun. Um, do I do I keep my puffer fish in here? Question mark. I thought I had more puffer fish. Could have sworn I had more puffer fish than just one. Hmm. Pff, fine, I'll just stick this. Oh, yeah, they're in here. There we go. Fine. The fact that they were in the chest I went to put that one in proves that my organization system is actually smarter than I thought. Or I'm smarter than I thought, one or the other, something like that. Anyway, the project I was planning on looking at today is uh, fish, 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 is a creeper farm. It's on my to-do list. Uh, let's see it here. Creeper farm. All right. So. I picked out a spot that I think I will uh, build it, and it's just offshore, and I should probably get some blocks to mark it out with. I think the elytra course is done, Wolf was asking on Discord whether anyone had tried it yet. Might have a go at that later. Anyway, the spot I've picked is just over here, in this little sort of corner of the shoreline. If I go F3 and G, we have a chunk just here. That I think will do nicely. I don't have to build it entirely in one chunk, but I think the main body of the farm with the spawning platforms does fit inside a single chunk. Uh, for the design I'm going with, which is Logical Geek Boys. Looks pretty pretty straightforward to build. Um, good rates, you know. It's designed for 114 and above. So that's what I'm going to go with. And this is all ocean, I've checked. Um, the ocean comes out, well I mean it'll come out to the shoreline pretty much because I've extended my shoreline slightly into the ocean. The main thing that might take a while with this one, uh, the torches. The main thing that might take a while with this one is getting cats. I have never yet gotten cats since they changed it to be cats rather than ocelots. I wouldn't imagine it's going to take a terribly long time. But yeah. The main reason I want to creep farm is to make loads of fireworks. A, so I can sell them, but B, so I've always got plenty myself. So, yeah. 
that's where I'm going to build this thing. I need to spend some time uh, digging downwards in this area because you want to build it as low as possible. Um, in an ideal world, I'll also light up all the surroundings because there are probably caves down there somewhere. Um, but the main thing I'm going to need to do is get that dog and get cats. And also sleep. Sleep? Do I want to sleep? I'm at 13 hours. I don't think I want to sleep. Do I want to sleep? I stopped um, by an episode or two back, didn't I? I stopped caring about the sleeping so much. Um, yeah, I certainly don't want to be out in the open because I will have phantoms. So, the puffer fishing was done by Wolf. I suspect that this stuff in the tip jar is also Wolf. I think he's pretty much the only person who comes over here, to be honest. Um, I'll put that away in a second. I have done the hole. The digging has been completed. It is all dig dug dig digged. And I don't know why I said that. Um, I expanded the outline of it. It's a 19 by 19 hole. Um, so that I can decorate the walls as well. And I've got, I think, all the materials I need. I think. I think. <laughs> Big question mark. Um, I've got blocks to build with. Um, stuff for the trap doors, the rails, the minecarts. Um, minecarts to put the cats in. I need to take the fish with me. A magma block, soul sand in case I need it. Some coloured blocks to build with. I'm thinking I'll do glass across the top and let the water cover it over again once I'm finished. But yeah. So the hole's done, that took a while. I got 16 diamond ore out of it and like 50 odd redstone. And I was far more excited about the redstone because I have so little of it at the moment because of all the stuff I build that uses loads of redstone. Okay, so what I need to do now is find villages. And I don't know whether cats can generate an existing villages or whether they have to be 114 villages. So let's have a look at amidst and head. Uh, which one should I get the villagers from? It was over here. I think it was a 114 y one. Go away, phantoms. No one cares. Okay, so I'm heading for minus 3000. 1,000 and a bit. I just need at least two cats, because then I can breed them. Okay, now this is an old style village. I'm going to leave before the villagers die too much, hopefully. Okay, the next one is 1,500... And three one hundred ish. Here we go. How's this one? I really should not be doing this at night. That's an old village as well. I don't know if they'll generate cats. What I really should do is sleep. Creepers. Uh Do I not have a bed with me? Yeah, I do. There it is. I was going to say, I used to carry a bed around with me all the time. Okay, let's see if there are any cats. Because I just saw a village with a hat, I think. So this is more like a mixed village. Hello, donkey. I'm not hearing any cats. 
Someone's been here. These aren't naturally generated blocks. Yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Puss, puss. No. No cats. No. No, no, no cats. This might take a while. Okay, this is a new style village and I definitely just saw a cat and I think I spotted another one over there. Oh, that's no, a horse. Okay. I definitely just saw a brown cat. So here's cat number one. Come on, puss. Did you go, puss, puss? This is still fish, right? That hasn't changed. It's just you do it to cats instead of ocelots now. Right? How close do I have to get before it starts paying attention to me? Hey, come back. Got done cats doing their own thing. I love cats, but crikey. Okay, that's one. Now let's see if there's another one around here. <gasps> there is, right there, awesome. Yeah, puss puss. This was easy, come on. Two cats, easy. Where'd you go? Can't see anything through all this tall grass. Where the heck did it go? Oh, come on, this is just annoying. <gasps> there you are. Finish it, get out of the way. Oh, god damn it. It's getting quite hard to see it through the grass. It's over there, it's over there. Sun's going down, come on. Come on. Oh my god. Okay, two cats. Two, two, two. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Oh my god. Of course, I have to get back to my base with this pair. Let's track down where I've left the other one. Where are you? And now, I've, and uh, why are they not following me properly? There's one. Where the heck is the other one? There. Come on. Yeah. 
Yes, you get on the bed, but not before I got into it, so nice try. Right. Now, will you two follow me? Come on. What? Why aren't you following me? Why are my two cats just sitting either side of this building and not following me? Are they trying to reach each other to breed? Is that what it is? What are you doing? I mean, they shouldn't be. Oh my god, they actually lie on the beds now. That's too cute. Come on, you little pain in the bum. God damn it, they've made cats even more cat-like than ever. How far away do I have to get before they teleport to me? Oh, this is going to take a while. I'll come back when I've somehow made it back to my base. Just bringing back the third and final cat. Yes, third, I found a grey one on my way to the shoreline as well. It's not been too bad getting them back. Um, I had to keep breaking beds and chests as I went past houses on my way out of the village. That's why they weren't following me, because they won't teleport to you if they're trying to sleep on a bed or something. So, cats. Um... But then I got to the shoreline, I made two of them sit down, got one in a boat, brought it over, went back, got another one, brought it over, pretty straightforward. Just bringing this one in, I've got the two brown ones over here, now. So I can breed these up, get enough for the farm. And then I can start building it. Right, I have three layers done, plus the bottom. So the magma is down there, and the unloading station is all done over in this corner here. So that's all down there. Three layers are built. However, I haven't got all the trapdoors in on the second layer yet. I was like... Five, five stacks of, of logs should be enough for all the trapdoors, right? Right, right? Uh, no, I've basically done two layers worth of trapdoors. So I need another 20 or so stacks of logs. But look, the cats are all ready. I've got three of them in. It's, it's progressing well. And I went to get more wool because I'd underestimated that as well. And I'm just growing some jungle trees. So it's, it's pr proceeding well. It's just I, I usually calculate materials beforehand and this proves me right in doing so because I vastly underestimated on this one. Okay, everything is built. I don't have walls on it yet, so I'm going to test this at night so it's dark. But all the cats are in, all the layers are in, all the roofs are in, everything's in. I'm going to punch out the torches and we can test this thing out. We have bats. Right. No, you can't see those on the camera account, but they're down there at the bottom. Okay. Um, I should probably turn this on. Just head down to the bottom and switch the system on.
Oh, I hear creepers falling. Let's just get out and stand somewhere in the water so I'm at least 24 away. Sun's going to come up in a minute, that sucks. Okay, let's have a look at what we've got. So, there's me, up there. Let's see. The rates won't be amazing. Um, first of all, because, oh, there's so many bats. What have they spawned on? Oh, creeper. Because I haven't done any lighting up of caves. Um, and I haven't hollowed out as much space as I could, so pack spawning won't be quite as useful as it could be. As I said before, I was going to let water cover... Oh, I need to wait for night again. I mean, some will still spawn on the inside, they just, it just won't spawn as many as it could. Um, I was going to let water cover this over. That would actually have made it dark enough at that depth. But, of course, having anything above the farm, any blocks, even transparent ones, reduces the efficiency because of the spawning algorithm. So actually, I can't do that. Okay, well we know it is working at least um, partially no gunpowder yet. Oh, of course, because this goes around until it's full, doesn't it? So what have we got? Four gunpowder. I'm going to have to wait until night for this to work. And then we can try it again. Okay. Sun is going down again. Let's have a look. Oh, that's not going to tell me anything. Creeper. Creeper, creeper. There we go. That's not bad rates. Considering no lighting up, I mean, there's... Oh, actually. There's a load of lighting up over here, yeah, and also it's underneath the Mushroom Island. So this bit's not going to spawn anything anyway. There's a load of ocean around here. So the amount of stuff I actually need to light up, because, yeah, there's these caves here that are full of enemies. That's bad. But then there's a great big space here with nothing in it as well. That's awesome. So the rates on this shouldn't be too bad. There we go. Creeper, creeper, creeper. Oh, nice. This isn't bad. For no conditioning of the area, this is pretty good. This can only get better. Well, that is, that is, a, that is a success then. That is definitely a success. I'll figure out a wall design in here, I'll decorate it a bit, I'll work out what I want to do at the top, it'll probably just be a glass tube to be honest. Just just inside the walls of the nether rack here, and then I'll take the nether rack down. It is a shame, I did want to do a big creeper facing glass on the top, but it can't be done. It'll reduce the efficiency too much. But that is definitely a success. And how are we doing on the gunpowder? Forty-two. It's a start. None, none in here yet, I presume. It won't have filled up once yet. That is awesome. Well, that's going to be it for this episode. If you enjoyed the video, remember to leave a like, share your favourite and comment, help support the channel, follow me on Twitter to search see what's going on, and subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>